Hello. The assignment for the week was, and I'm reading off my other computer, because I have my memory again. It's a sketch when you shake it, it goes. Anyway, okay. Um, how do I want the world to be different because I lived in it? Uh, your existence is already a factor in world history now. What sort of factor do you want it to be? Maybe you want to create worldwide prosperity or worldwide prosperity, either one, one of the two would probably be okay. A uh, beautiful family or one really excellent bagel? If your impressions are more ba vague, keep asking the question. Eventually, you'll glimpse clearer outlines for your destiny. Live by design, not by accident. So, what does that mean to me? I think the last statement to live by design and not by accident is very powerful if you think about it. If you um, feel that your life is kind of adrift and you just uh, come and go as the wind blows, uh, then maybe you should start thinking about that. Maybe that's something to think about. Me, um, I, I went through a time with that where I, I just kind of bounced here and there and just enjoyed life and whatnot, but not as much as I could have. But <clears throat> So, to the question, how do I want to impact the world? Hopefully not in a crater in an airplane seat. See the impact? See what I did there? Um, never mind. Probably not a good example. The, the things that I'm doing to impact the world, I think, are teaching is one of the biggest the um, the opportunity to inspire, hopefully, to give people um, a desire to learn or help people to learn, get people past the uh, concerns and fears about technology, stuff like that. That I think is would be really big um, because it's not going away. It's, computers are always going to be here. You're always going to be dealing with this stuff. Um, so. If I can help in, in a small part, or if I can help some person that, you know, was not into computers to, you know, not necessarily, I don't expect to, like, make the next Albert Einstein or the next, you know, Stephen Hawking or, or you know, Kevin Mitnick, for any of y'all that know who he is. Um, that's fine, but I don't want to stop trying. I mean, beyond, you know, my, my job, I want to obviously to have a positive impact on my family, to, you know, to have the kids grow up and, and be responsible people that can go out into society and really do something on their own and not have to always be dependent on someone or something like that. Um, I, I kind of really think about it a lot. I mean, I, I there's only so many hours in the day, unfortunately, sometimes, but, and sometimes there seems like there's way too many <laughs> hours in the day, but, you know, so, I want to impact the world as it relates to the influence that I have on people around me, and not in a bad way, but in a, in a positive way, maybe inspiring, hopefully, um, even if, if it's just someone comes to my class and, and they're they're sad, they're depressed, they're not happy and something I do can make them smile for a minute. Forget forget maybe their problems for a little while. I think that's that's super. How great is that? Because I so many times that I've been you know completely depressed about something, miserable about something, upset about something and to have something just turn that around even for a little while is just so wonderful. So hopefully that is something that I, I can do, something that I've done for, for maybe some of you guys, you know, um, I hope. So that is how I want to impact the world.